Shalom. I want to first start off giving all praises, honor, and glory unto Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Makakwadash. Double honors to the elder high priests, the teachers of our apostles, as well as our apostles and elder bishops at Great Millstone. You know, peace and blessings unto the 144,000 and the rest of the elect of the nation of Israel. This is the brother Abadia from the GMS Houston camp. And I have a quick um, video that I'm going to do. I have a couple of couple of scriptures to bring out out of the book of uh, Philippians chapter 3. And I'm going to read verses um, 14. I'm sorry, 13 and 14. And we're going to get straight into it. It says, brethren, this is uh, Paul. And this applies to, you know, ultimately this applies to the elect. It says, brethren, I count not myself to have apprehended. And what does Paul mean by this? He means, because Paul had, you know, prior to this uh, statement in this, uh, in this letter that he wrote to the church of uh, Philemon, he, uh, I'm sorry, Philippi, not Philemon, Philippi, excuse me. He had put in a lot of, he had been putting in a lot of work, you know, traveling, spreading, spreading the word, setting uh, up order, okay? And he made this point, he said, brethren, I count not myself to have apprehended, meaning since they even put in all this work the, so far or thus far at that time period, um, he don't count that he he uh, laid hold on the on the kingdom. I mean, he's done enough work to 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 make it, or say I'm good. Let's look at that word apprehended, so we can uh, get a little bit more context on this uh, verse or this part of the verse. Strong's G, 2638, Catalambano, Catalambano. Okay. And it says, to lay hold of, to lay hold of, so as to make one's own, to obtain, attain to, to make one's own, to take into oneself, appropriate, to seize upon, take possession of. So Paul was basically saying he didn't, he don't have the, the mindset of, that he's uh, gonna be saved, or uh, you know, based on all the works that he's done. Because in order, you have to be saved in order to to um, get the kingdom, and especially being the uh, be the being the first fruits of the kingdom. Meaning, when Yahweh comes back, be part of the, uh, you know that salvation and. and uh, you know, part of that um, process of us setting up this planet, getting this planet Earth in order. Okay? I'm going to go back to the verse. It says, Brethren, I count not myself to have apprehended, but this one thing I do, forgetting those things which are behind and uh, reaching forth unto those things which are before. So not saying, man, I'm shit, I'm good. I didn't put in this work. I should be good enough to to be saved, you know, and and enjoy the benefits of the kingdom. Because you have some Israelites that, you know, have that mentality. They just know they got a, 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 a spot in salvation, guaranteed 100%, not a doubt on the, on the planet Earth. Some of these other Israelite groups. Or individuals in the group. I ain't going to say all of the, the, the whole group, but there's individuals in these different Israelite groups, you know, that believe like that. Then you have other Israelites. They just believe as long as you know you're an Israelite, that's it. You know you're an Israelite, you, you know, you saved. Like, they they good. They going to be in the kingdom. Well, ultimately, they'll be in the kingdom. But we want to all make it on this first go round. us that... You know, know that we're Israelites and have this understanding. All right. So the, the point is we got to 
you know, we can't focus on all the, the work we didn't put in, you know, over the over these years. We got to keep pushing, okay? Keep putting in the work. Keep being diligent, okay? Being a brother, all the things, all the things that uh, can uh, comprise as far as our duties in this ministry, okay? Next verse it says, "I press toward, I press toward the mark." And what's the mark? The mark is the uh, is the end or salvation for the prize. The prize is the is the kingdom. So we're trying to make it to the end to 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 be saved, right? Because the scriptures say, um, "For he that endure it uh, to the end shall be saved." Okay, so we make it to the end, you be saved, and then what? We get the um the kingdom on this planet earth. It says, For I I'm sorry, I press toward the mark for the prize of the high calling, because yeah, the high calling meaning in order to well, we are we're doing this work and we were called to do this work, and it ain't any old calling, it's a high calling. I wanna see what that word high what we have for the word, or what the blue letter has for the word um, high. Because the scriptures say, you know, many are called, but few are, few are chosen. A, of the quarters of the heaven. Yeah, this was a heavenly, <laughs> I like that. Um, I'll stop right there, going on uh, number two, or Roman numeral two. It says, of the quarters of the heaven, you know, and I really just stop right there. It says, up, upwards, above, on high, so this is a heavenly calling. This is a calling from the, the spiritual realm, from the, the most high, Yahweh. okay, through his son, Yahweh Shai, right? Because it tells us in St. John 15 and 16, Ye have not chosen me. This is out of the mouth of Yahweh Shai. Ye have not chosen me, but I have chosen you and ordained you to go forth and bring forth fruit, meat for repentance. All right. So let's go back to the verse. All right. It says, I press toward the mark for the prize of the high calling of Yahweh in Mashiach, Yahweh Shai. Okay, so we're going to, through this high calling, is, gonna, is how we're uh, able to press toward the mark for the prize, right? We the, the calling is to do this call. We were called to do this work, to be diligent in the, in the ministry, right? And that's our, uh, and as we, if we're doing that, that means we're pressing toward the mark for the prize, you know what I'm saying, and not um, getting comfortable, you know, not going out um, when the only when the weather is good, you know, or going out uh, all year round, all right, doing videos. You know, being a being a being a sincere brother in the in this ministry. Okay. So I'm gonna end the video right there. You know, the, the point was we gotta keep, you know, me bringing this out was we gotta keep, you know, we gotta keep pushing. There is no getting comfortable. There is no we didn't put in all this work. Look at me. You know. So Lord willing, once again, this was edifying. And until the next video, I say shalom.